All right, we're out here again. Another detail, as you see, is cloudy. They said it was supposed to rain, but we got a Nissan um, Amarta. A um, little dusty pet hair. So we're gonna take care of this vehicle, get it situated. I'm um, just doing the inspects on it. Yeah, man, it's kind of beat up, but we'll get it right. Um, about to show you what's going on. It's the only one we got today so far. And then I'm gonna give you an overall view of how it looks. Stay tuned. So this is the interior. As you see, it's a lot of pit here. A lot of pit here. Go get this jump right. She got three seats in here. She pit here all right here too as well. And right there. All that pit here. That's what that looks like. Third, I'm gonna get them right. These are the wheels. You know, this is bad. That's the outside of it. Definitely get it right today. All right, so in a situation where you have a lot of pet hair like on the doors, instead of me getting like a microfiber towel and I'm wiping it or a wet one and wiping it, I use like uh, my dry brush to get inside the cracks and kind of brush everything out. And then I go in with a microfiber towel right after. You can do it either way, but that's the way I do it because a lot of this pet hair is in cracks and crevices. So I kind of tend to use a brush to kind of brush it out. Like a broom kind of, but it's a, it's a light brush. So it gets into the cracks and crevices and it brushes out like the pet hair. And then I'm able to go behind it with a microfiber and just clean it up. So I take this brush right here, and as you see, like it's all in the cracks, and I just brush. Kind of go back and forth and just be real quick with it. And as you see, just kind of knock majority of this pet hair off of like these places. And then I go in with a brush. It's kind of damp a little bit too, as well. So it's like it gets all the pit hair that's kind of stuck in there out especially in like places like that where you can't really reach with your fingers so you definitely need something like this and as you see it's a lot better you know we still got to come back with a microfiber and wipe all that up but that's the case and then places like this too as well just come in here and just see all that how just went into that one area then He's gonna come behind me and vacuum anyway, so I'm not really worried about where the pet hair lands. We just wanna get it out of this area so it doesn't fall back over here. So I brush it out like that. Come back with a mighty fiber and bring it all up. So again, it's the same thing with the chair too, as wide as like you see inside there. I try to just get, get out as much as I can and just brush it. behind me and backing the rest up so kind of make it a little bit easier on
closer, getting closer to the finish time. And that is a wrap. We are all done. The car looks great. Uh, we got an extra $25 tip, which was good. So appreciate y'all. Thank you for tuning in. And see you in the next one. Peace out.